So when your Mac starts up, there are applications, there are services, there are processes that start up in the background. Some of these you will see starting up because you'll have a little taskbar or you'll have little applications that sort of show up, little icons that just show up and you're wondering how are they starting? You can remove startup items to improve the performance of your Mac. Hey, my name is Emilio and I release a lot of videos on all things tech, including a lot of stuff on the Mac. So do remember to always subscribe, click on the button on the bell so you don't miss out on any of my new videos where we talk about Mac and a whole bunch of other things in tech. Now we're doing this on Mac OS Big Sur, but if you're running a different version of Mac OS, that is fine. We're gonna now cross over to our Mac. Now what you do is you open up the system preferences area right here, I've got a little icon. You can also go into the top left-hand corner, the Apple logo and select system preferences. You're gonna be provided a whole bunch of options within your system preferences area, and we wanna select users and groups. Within users and groups, you're gonna be provided a list of all of the users that are users of your Mac. Mac. You could have one, you could have many. And what you're gonna to need to do is you're gonna to have to select each individual user and do this repeated more than once against each individual user. So in our case, this is our user. So we're gonna select it and we're gonna click on login items. And you're gonna be provided a list of applications, list of files. And it says that these items will open automatically when you log in and actually remove applications, remove files, remove anything that is running in here so that it doesn't start up automatically from your Mac. So for example, if you don't want the time machine to start up automatically, you select the time machine and then you remove it. If you don't want this PDF from starting up automatically, you select it and then click on the minus. Now you can also add items onto here. You can click on the plus and add items that you perhaps do want to start up automatically. But generally the less things you've got in here, the quicker your Mac will start. So now all of those applications, all of those files have now been removed from my login items. So now when my Mac starts up, it's not having to load all of those in the background and then you're gonna get generally better performance now out of your Mac during the boot startup. Hey, why don't you let me know in the comments whether you had stuff in your startup items that were driving you crazy. You didn't even know why they were starting up and now you're able to remove them. Why don't you let me know what you had in there and whether you're able to get those out and whether your Mac is now running and booting a little bit faster. Also give me a thumbs up if you did like it and if you wanna keep on track of all of my video releases where we talk about all things tech but a lot of stuff around the Mac, why don't you click on the subscription button and on the bell so that you don't miss out on anything. Thanks for tuning in. We'll talk to you next time.